ربيو او بحنو كان ام كيا هي سو ايك دو تين تشار لايك باراتا سو ماتش كول ات دال ان باكستاني بات ان عربي كو كول تشيكن تيكا مسالا الله باكني هير اي ام ويت سليمان سليمان سعيد از فروم يوغندا اند ميبي هي كان تيل ذا ديتيلز اباوت هيم سيلف يس سليمان Uh, I'm called Suleiman Saeed Hassan Naamani. Naamani is my family name. My yeah, my culture name. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I am I am originally from Oman. As in, I was born to two Omani parents, and I was born in Kenya. I grew up in Uganda, and I'm a fiber optics technician. And how you, from where you learn learned this uh, chapati, the Pakistani chapati, Indian chapati to me? Yeah, to be honest, uh, you know, it's just about culture and uh, how we are raised, you know. Uh, I'm someone who was raised from the beginning, uh, very close to my mother. That's where I first picked it up. I used to sit close to her so many times when she's cooking it and I observe basically. I'm someone who is so observative, so I used to observe and just see. And then uh, to top it up all, I got married to my wife. And then now I started practicing it like practically. So, so I use... <coughs> you are becoming perfect after marriage. Yes, of course. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So <laughs> Although this is so common everywhere in the world, you know, after marriage, you become so perfect. Yes, in yes, yes. You know, things. they usually say every successful man, there is a, there is a woman behind her, him. How a person become unsuccessful? Um, <laughs> if you if you pick the wrong wife, so if you ask Allah to give you the perfect wife, he will give you the perfect wife. Okay, you know now this chapati you made, actually this is a very common, uh, you can say the component of uh, Pakistani kitchen and Pakistani dining. Yes. You know that? Yeah, I know. I, I know that. You the same here in, in India. Yeah, yeah. I've, uh, me, myself, personally, I've tried to eat in uh, Pakistani restaurants, maybe in Uganda, even in... Uh, I've also been in Dubai. I also ate some of the pa Pakistani delicacies. I I like the purato so much, yeah. So Purato? Purato, yes. Paratha. Paratha. Is it paratha? Yes. Parata. Yeah, I like paratha so much. <laughs> Any message for Pakistanis and Indians? Um, the Pakistani and Indian community, I just want to urge you to get back together, reunite. Uh, it's so important for you guys. You've stayed together for a very long time in terms of history. So it's, uh, this is the right time for you to come together and work together and be one, economic, one, one economy because of uh, the population and the power you guys have in terms of technology, in terms of uh, like industrialization. So the only way you, you could be successful in Asia, in fact, not only in India and Pakistan, but the entire Asia, because your influence will be taken 
all the way to the entire continent. Mm -hmm. It's by you guys uniting and uh, working together to see how best you yeah, could we, take the I future think, ahead. Uh, let me add a little bit, a uh, few things here. Yeah. Many, I think we stop fighting. That is the most important. Uh, mm -hmm. Political or um, religious. Religious. Any type yes. of fighting we should stop. We yes. automatically become very strong. Yes. Because we are wasting our energies in fightings and. Uh, unnecessary conflicts yes so i think uh, this is my point of view i think uh, suleiman saying the same yeah thing. i'm also saying that the same okay, thing uh, we are two different countries but we are still brothers and sisters and uh, we should uh, stop unnecessary fighting unnecessary conflicts yes true and uh, besides that you all know the history behind oman and uh, pakistan it's so yeah, important, we, you yeah, know we how love, uh, we love each other. We've been brothers for a very long time and we are still brothers.